Diamond Head area Bogart's Cafe is excited to share its new dinner menu. And to get a first look, we sent Dallas on Taveros over to check out the brand new dinner menu. And oh, already making us hungry this morning. So Dallas, what you got? Ooh, Kelly and Christine, you are just going to die at the studio because take a look at what we have right here. These are some beautiful entrees that you could pick up now at Bogart's Cafe. They are open for dinner from 5.30 to 9 o'clock, Wednesday through Sunday. And I'm here joined by Maria, who is the owner of Bogart's Cafe. Good morning, Maria. Good morning. Thank you for coming here. Absolutely. Thank you for having us. And I'm also joined by the head chef, Mitchell. What's up, Mitchell? Um, oh. Just cooking up a storm to, this just morning. Yeah. Storm. yeah, I'll give you guys just an insight on what happened during uh, the commercial break the last time you saw this. He prepared all of this for us. So we're going to go ahead and break it down. So let's go ahead and start with this entree right here. Most of the food items that you're going to find at Bogart's Cafe is highly Italian influenced. So what is this pasta that we're looking at, Mitchell? This is a pescatore tagliatelle. It's fresh homemade pasta with uh, fresh seafood, um, lobster, shrimp, clams, and a white wine tomato sauce. Fresh birds. Nice. Very filling. Does this come with a side of bread or anything? No, oh, we have like a nice assortment of bread. We have focaccia and cheese balls, like uh, this um, um, Brazilian special uh, bread that we also have. Perfect. Because that sauce right there, I know I'm going to get down when I got that garlic bread at hand. What are we looking at right here? This pasta over here. This one is called cashew and pepe, which is my favorite dish. Uh, this cheese that we use, we, uh, it's a, an exclusive of Bogart's. I bring it all the way from Italy. So yeah. things are truly authentic when they come over we, here in a way, right? We try to be as close as possible. Um, I worked in Italy for five weeks, and I really wanted to be to make dishes that are very close to what they serve in Italy. Yeah, and I feel like we don't have too much Italian flavors in this side of town in a little bit on the no. island, right? No, that's why I want people to come here. That's why I open for um, dinner, there serving Italian food, because, you know, there is no Italian food around here. Perfect. That makes sense. This and, area, anyway. Yeah, this area, at least. What's this one? Right here. This one looks very savory. Oh no! This is one of this is Mitchell's and I's uh, favorite uh, dish. This is a veal cheek with bordelais sauce and uh, mashed potatoes. Perfect, and it looks like that will just fall off pretty it is. easily. It's all up the bone. Mm -hmm. And then I see these breads over here. These yeah. look really good. Now this is our uh, focaccia and Parmesan um, cheese balls okay. with a hint of white, um, English white cheddar. Mm. And that's something that's baked daily? Yes, we bake that every afternoon. Okay. And then for those who didn't see us in the last half hour, this fried calamari shrimp mix right here. What is this? Yeah, this is a uh, misto with um, shrimp and calamari, and it is served with uh, black garlic aioli. Oh, okay. So that's uh, served as a dipping dish. sauce? Yes, I know. It's a dipping sauce. It's delicious. And now, is this more of an appetizer or an entree yes. or maybe both? It, this is an appetizer, and these three dishes here um, um, are entrees. And you know, once you finish your entrees, they also have dessert as well, which. Yes, that's look our house made um, chocolate cake. House made chocolate cake. Now, this looks like it could do some damage on the calories yes, intake. Yes, but it, you know, it's, it's not so worth sweet. it. Yeah, it's yeah. worth it. It's so worth it, and plus, there's a park right next door and Diamond Head right around the corner, so you're going to burn off anyways. And they also have delicious drinks, too, like the cold brew that you see right here. I'm about to drink that down. And then, what is this right here? That is our um, Lily Koi um, Mimosa. Mm -hmm. Lily Koi Mimosa. Okay, perfect. Now, I don't know where to start. You can see I got my bib on right now. Okay. But what's the first thing I should try as we wrap this up? I think you should start with this one. Okay, will you eat with me? Down. Sure. Okay, cool. This is my favorite dish anyway, Good. so I will join you. All right, I shouldn't use my hands. I should probably use a fork, huh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what about you, Mitchell? Get something here. Get a fork. Yeah, you All must right, have cool. the black garlic aioli. Okay, I'm going to try. This is just delicious with it. Black garlic aioli. Oh, wait, I'm going to go ahead and just squeeze a little bit of lemon. Okay. Because i got to have a little bit of zest right here. You guys want some? No, I'm good. A little bit? All right. <laughs> well, perfect. Like I mentioned, Bogart's Cafe is now open for dinner Wednesday through Sunday from 5.30 to 9 o'clock. You can check it out here and check out all these delicious entrees you just saw. And, of course, we'll have these segments again on our website at khon2.com. And until then, reporting from Bogart's Cafe, Dawson Navarro, singing back to you guys in the studio. How is it, Dallas? Oh, um, oh good. Better hot. <laughs> but you must try this one. Everything is better hot, but <laughs> that all looks so good. Dallas, what do you think? How was that fight? Boom! It's bomb. Very crispy. <laughs> the garlic 
what is it, black aioli? Black garlic aioli. Black garlic aioli. You know I'm a sauce guy, yes. so anything that comes with sauce is my thing. Mm. Very good pairing. Yay. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm happy for, oh, Just add a little so bit smart. of lemon zest? Yes, mm. get yeah. the zest on there. I'm so happy for Dallas. What a great way to kick off Friday. Yes. Good for him. Good for him, and you experienced that, and you said mm -hmm. it was it's so good. That's why I'm like extra happy because I'm just like, yes, you're getting such good food today. Oh, it, and I do highly recommend it. I mean, of mm -hmm. course, they're all known for their great breakfast, but yep. the dinner. It looks great. Mm -hmm. All right, stay with us. We'll be right back. My stomach just growled. I was like, oh.